so what I'm doing is I'm stacking Mauler's Fury and the passive um, Mauler's Fury and Greed. Okay. Now I don't have any other passives selected, and I have a slash damage ring on. And then I don't have anything specced into strength. So by me doing this. I'm now at 10 stacks of Molar Fury, three stacks of Greed, and I'm hitting you for 432 consistently. Okay. Now I'm putting a Jasper in. I'm going to duel you again. I'm going to get to max stacks of Molar Fury again, and I'm going to have you light attack me while I'm doing it, but only when I say to. All right, light attack me. Doesn't work at all. Jaspers just don't work. No, Jaspers do work. Jaspers do work, but don't go over in power cap. Jaspers ass. Because I have max stacks of Mauler's Fury, right? Which is 3% times 10, which is 30%, right? I have max stacks of Greed, which is 3 stacks of 5%, 15%. You add those two together, you're at 45%. You add a slash damage ring, which is 7%. You're at 52%. Um, and power cap is 50%. So if by you hitting me, the number not doesn't change whatsoever, that means Jasper counts towards in power cap, which is bad for great axes. Very bad. So yeah, Jasper counts towards in power cap. Make sure you keep the same gear on. Oh. All right. Now I'm going to place this onyx in here. I should be doing the same amount of damage. If you can, do you have a hearty meals on you? Or like a regen potion or something? Um, once you start to take damage, just take a regen pot. Just try to stay as high of health as you possibly can. Okay, so that goes over in power cap. Okay. Uh, Onyx. Onyx goes over in power cap. Uh, now you just need to let me beat the fuck out of you without you healing at all. Actually, if you have regenerating on, on your earring, can you take it off? You might not be able to while we're dueling. You take it off? Or, oh, okay. Alright, so no regenerating. Perfect. Now we're going to test Emerald and see if that goes over in power cap. So now just stand there and take damage. I gotta get you under 50% health. Okay, it does. Goes over in power cap as well. Now, just again, for science... 
another Jasper. So, just literally keep light attacking me. No, no, no. You want to keep all your health. You just want to keep light attacking me. Um, so, we know 432 is our max with smaller sphere. So just, yeah, just keep light attacking. So you can actually see the Jasper proccing on my bar as well. 3x, 3x, and then 10x. But I'm still doing the same amount of damage. I mean, Jasper does not go over power caps. Okay. Cool. Thanks, Wolf. They're going to chill there. I'm going to put a Moonstone in. If it goes over in power cap, all my abilities have to be on cooldown. And I should do 20% more damage. So you just chill there. Nope. You just stand there and look pretty. Alright, so it goes over. Good to know. Now we're testing Opal to see if it still goes over in power cap, which it used to, but we'll see what the new changes. Wolf and I have been testing so long that it is now dark outside in the world. <laughs> oh, okay. That's not, not a terrible thing, but like, I just need to know what our baseline is now, right? It was 432. I kind of wanted to keep it that, but since you changed stuff, it's fine. Okay. So, like, we just know that our new base is going to be uh, 399, right? Yeah. Okay. So, Opal still goes over in Power Cup. So, in conclusion, we figured out that Jasper is the only thing that actually counts towards in Power Cap when it comes to spotting a gem. Opal's moonstone emeralds and onyx all go above in power cap do what you will with that information and we'll keep testing <laughs>